fire that trumped our leaves one civilian dead. Four firefighters with minor injuries New York City firefighters on Saturday are battling the fire on the 50th floor of Trump Tower, the fire department tweeted. The FDND said at 7 p.m. that it was a four-alarm fire. The cause is unknown. The NYPD said a 51-year-old man from the 50th floor died at a local hospital. Four firefighters suffered minor injuries, including two with burns. Over 44 units and about 190 firefighters responded. Fire Commissioner Dan Negro said units went up with the Secret Service to check President Trump's residence. Some smoke reached some of floors above the fire, he said, but it was unclear if it had reached Mr. Trump's residence. There were no members of First Family in residence. President Trump tweeted at 6.43 p.m. that the fire had been extinguished, although Negro said it wasn't under control due to the smoke conditions on the upper floors. Mr. Trump's son Eric who lives in a nearby Trump Park building, tweeted that the fire had been extinguished. He also thanked the fire department. Trump Tower, which opened in 1983, is located on 5th Avenue and 57th Street in New York City. Before moving to the White House, Mr. Trump, the First Lady and Baron Trump lived in the triplex penthouse apartment, which occupied sections of floors 66 to 68, according to Forbes. There was a fire at Trump Tower in January. Two people suffered minor injuries in that fire, CBS New York reports.